for us at 5 o'clock. Some young Muslims in the Chicago area are fighting radicalization of their religion as they try to stop people from being recruited by groups, including ISIS. They stress the violence seen around the world does not represent Islam. Eyewitness News reporter Ravi Bechwal has their story. Ravi. Ron, with the terror in Paris causing those who love freedom everywhere to think really hard about what's going on, a group of Ahmadiyya Muslims gathered at the College of DuPage to explain that terrorists are using Islamic ideology as a tactic to divide Muslims and gain power. And their brutal methods have no basis in the true reading of the Muslim faith. These recent attacks in Paris and in Beirut and in Nigeria and all over the world that are supposedly perpetrated in the name of Islam are absolutely wrong. Imam Azam Akram sets off in a talk to students, faculty and others gathered in response to a call to stop the crisis and get inside what motivates people to turn to terrorism through ISIS, a name he avoids using the derisive Arabic term Daesh or something to stomp on. This is exactly what they want. They want to instill fear in people, terrorize the people and we're not going to let that ha happen as, as Muslims. Joined by fellow Ahmadiyya Muslims, a sect persecuted, they say, by radical Muslims and some governments, including Pakistan, for preaching nonviolence and Islam's true meaning, that life is about love for all and hatred toward none, the Imam said he travels the Midwest to combat ignorance that gets ISIS its followers. They feed off the ignorance of the masses, number one. Ignorance, and then they, they spread terror. Terror leads to fear, fear leads to hate. In the aftermath of Paris and today's raid of another alleged terror cell, Ahmadiyya say radicalization has long been offered as an easy answer to the challenges of growing and prospering. A fellow imam said those worried about radicalization of American youth need to join with voices such as his to call out what is really going on with ISIS. Daesh is using media, they're using a global voice to uh, further their propaganda. The only way to uh, beat them is to use the same tactic. Use the media and get the better version out. And there's another talk today at 5.30 at the College of DuPage. And the Ahmadiyyas are promising they will be out there a lot more despite threats that they've received both from outside and inside the religion. Ron and Cheryl, big job ahead for them, but they say they're up for it. All right. Thanks, Ravi.